Hey guys, shall we here playing more Danganronpa 2 Goodbye Despair? It has been more than a month since I logged in into this game, and I have no idea where I am. Supposedly this is the end of the third chapter, we finished the third island, and... I don't know, let's see where we go from here. Hajime says, We were hoping things would progress smoothly. Hmm... That's right, a common ordinary progression would have been just fine. Like, for example, the enemy's lair crumbling right after you defeat the final boss, or your dead friend suddenly reappearing. It would have been just fine if things had progressed like that. That's the kind of old school progression we were hoping for. Note, this unreasonable turn of events. Oh, the creators of this game really go out of their way to say like, oh, we write the story so much differently than any other game you've played. Oh. Name's Nekomaru Nidai! I've been reborn in the rivers of hell! I remember this. Uh, he had been introduced before, like... Well, maybe I'm playing like the, the ending again, so... N Nekomaru? Is that you? <laughs> no matter how you look at it, I'm still me! No matter how we look at it, this isn't you at all! He looks very happy Jeez. to be a robot. Jeez, you guys are a strange lot! You all such big white eyes. <laughs> oh, perhaps you're all falling in love with this metallic body of mine. <laughs> ah, ha, 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 I already know what you want to say just by looking in your eyes. Then again, I am a former team manager. <laughs> oh, look at her. She's blue now. <gasps> what happened? You look like you've seen a ghost or something. You. Hey, man, says Soda. Don't go scaring me Estonia with that strange ass mask. As he raised his stammering voice, Kazuchi grabbed onto Nekomaru's head and... I already know! Come on, take it off! <laughs> oh no, stop trying to grab his head. Stop it! <laughs> He's getting a bit pissed off. Hey, hey! Hey, why won't it come off, says Soda. Wait, what? Are you freaking kidding me? Ah! He, this guy makes the best faces. Pure electricity! It's not just for show, it's pure electricity. I've been reborn as pure electricity. <laughs> okay. If you are serious in Nekomaru, Sasakane, then we cannot have children. Okay. Damn it. That's my fault, right? You ended up getting a body like that. And it's all my fault, right? S sorry Sorry, Nekomaru. I don't know how to apologize for this. <laughs> don't worry about it. A lot of stuff happens when you're alive. You serious? You're too upbeat, says Soda. Is this really okay? <laughs> if you keep sweating the small stuff, you're going to end up getting more great hairs. Hey, hey. Commenting on every little thing he does is a waste of time, says Kusuryu. Uh, hey. But... You're really Nekomaru, right? You came back for us, right? <laughs> That's right, I've resurrected from the depth of hell in shining silver! You... How are you even okay with that, says Kusuryu? It doesn't even compare to my eye patch. How can you accept that body? Oh! It's better to just be alive. Such a nice cool guy. Huh? 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 It's better to just be alive. Hey, don't you agree? If I'm alive, I can stick to still talk to you all. And I if I'm alive, I can still fight. Show some spirit! It doesn't matter what happens to my body. Not one bit. Amazing! Oh no, this guy, what do you have to bring him up? Hajime says, It's better to just to be alive. Sorry, it's better to just be alive. I do understand what Nekomaru is saying, but... No matter how we sense this, it's just too weird. This isn't a novel or a movie, this is reality. Can something this unexplainable really be allowed to happen? No, instead... Why did this happen? Um... Anyway, I'm glad. That's fine, right? Says Chiaki. 
right? Nekomaru definitely came back to us. Well, he definitely did, but not as like he was like what what? What's this? My my, am I interrupting your touching reunion? Says Monokuma. Wa 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 wa! Says Monami. Why is Nekomaru a robot? Hey, um. Unfortunately, says Monokuma, it was truly difficult to save Nekomaru from the jaws of death. But they don't call me the Psycho Pop Magician for nothing. Psycho Pop Magician. Oh my goodness! Such a wonderful before and after has occurred! <laughs> It appears to be a little too dramatic, says Nekomaru. Thanks to that, I'm getting stabbed by all these envious stares. Hey, hey! Hey, if you're really a robot, what's going on with your thought process, says Soda? Is that a program too? Then what happened to the other stuff like your self-awareness and... Fool! Fool, how many times do I have to tell you that it doesn't matter? No matter what shape or form I take, I am Nakumaru Nidai! You see? Says Hajime. Is he going to power through the rest of his life with these new abilities? Hmm. That kind of reaction, says Soda. It looks like you really are self aware. <gasps> that means this technology is insane! I've never seen or heard anything like this before. Phew! What a commoner considers advance is not much of an advancement, says Nekomaru. Sorry, it says um, Monokuma. If you think advancement exists in colleges and laboratories, that's a huge misunderstanding. <laughs> the real advancements exist in the place where you can pass on that talent. Hey, hey! And you're saying that to you? Were you really that amazing? says Soda. You! Stop admiring him! Says Akane. <laughs> you stupid stuff, animal! Don't go screwing with people's bodies like that! What? Hold on, if you harm Monokuma, you're go going to. Says Kusuryu. <laughs> oh, you intend to defy me yet again? You're quite a barbarian. Disappear! Jeez, this time you will definitely fall prey to my Monokuma bazooka. And. The story repeats itself. Once again, the world shook and turned stark white. As if the surrounding environment and that all sound was blown away by the impact. Turning everything completely white. And within that whiteness, I heard that voice yet again. Ah! Ah! Ne Nekomaru! <laughs> he looks happy. That didn't phase me at all! Check it out! I'm intact! I have no injuries at all! Hey, hey! Are you serious? says Kusuryu. He took that blast and doesn't even have a single scratch! <sighs> awesome! says Soda. He's seriously a real robot. <gasps> hey, can you let me disassemble, disassemble you? Can you let me disassemble you and show me your insides? No! <laughs> that is exactly what you should respond to, guys. Always say it. no thank you. If someone, like, offers to disembowel you. Uh, if I get disassembled, I'll end up dying. By the way... I suppose I should fill you in, says Monoguma. Even though he's a robot now, if Nekomaru is killed, it's still going to count as murder, okay? Of course! Of course, it's possible that Nekomaru might kill someone instead. Fool! Don't say such foolish things, that will never happen. <laughs> well, with all that in mind, you guys enjoy the killing school trip together. Let's get along! Once again, I hope we can all get along, says Nekomaru Nidai. It's impossible. It's impossible, it's gonna be a while before I can mentally process this, says Kusuryu. Um... Uh, will Nekomaru never return to his original form, says Sonia. If that is the case, it is a burden for Nekomaru. Sheesh! Hey, hey, it's not like I came back as a monster. I'm just a robot now, you know? Hmm. I'm sorry, I can't really see a difference, says Chiaki. 
her mind is like destroyed by video games. Uh huh. Well, just consider this a little promotion. Um, promotion as in like it has been promoted, or promotion as in like, um, uh, you know, a sale. By making a robot one of the main characters, a genuine mystery is transformed into sci-fi mystery. <sighs> and the hard boil is transformed into cyberpunk. Hey. You're totally destroying the genres, says Monami. <laughs> oh well, who cares? As long as it's fun, it's totally fine. <laughs> Damn. As I listened to Monokuma's boisterous laugh, once again I was forced to accept. This island is not the day-to-day -day world I know. It's a mad world where the strange is accepted as normal. Causes reasoning, circumstances foreshadowing, these things don't apply here at all. That's what it means to live in a mad world. Um, do you remember that series called Daria? Where there was this TV show that was mad sad world or something. Sad mad world. That was the only TV show that they watched in that series. Quite funny. Um, the ultimate robot stream of clockwork. Okay, that is a reference to uh, Philip K. Dick, the robot stream of electric ship or something. Uh, the next morning, we gather at the hotel restaurant, like we always do. Okay, this is going fast. Man, the food today was awesome as usual, says Akane. <laughs> as always, you sure eat a lot. I feel relaxed just by looking at you. It's impossible not to worry about it, says Kojima. No matter what, this feels really strange. It's not something that'll get used to easily. Hey, hey. Anyway, what are you gonna do? Mekamaru. <laughs> I like that new name. Mekamaru, says Hajime. You're used to him already? <clears throat> what am I going to do, says Mekamaru. Hmm. For food you need, like, oil, says Chiaki. Hey, hey. Regular, premium. Well... Nah, he doesn't need oil. Since he said he's pure electricity, maybe he's uh, battery pow powered or something. Fool! I can totally eat normal food, especially rice dishes. I can't get my eyes off them. <laughs> However, I've been feeling a little down today, so I don't have much of an appetite. Okay, he's in complete denial. All right. Are you malfunctioning? If you show me your insights, I can fix you up, you know? <laughs> No means no. Haven't you heard the feminist, you soda? <laughs> ha 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 ha, says Nagito. <laughs> what? So you're here too, says Kusurio. Sorry. I'm sorry. I should know my place and not speak out of turn when anyone's gathered together like this. However, I just wanted to make sure I spoke to you about what happened yesterday. What happened yesterday, says Hajime. Hmm. That person, Mikan called her l beloved. I do not remember that. It was too long ago. I can't help thinking about that, and I won't get out, and it won't get out of my head. Who was it? Did she call her beloved? What? Am I just a coward for worrying about that? Says Nagito. Let me tell you this. It crossed my mind as well, but based on how she phrased it. So this is the end, says Mikan. This is really... Now I can go to my beloved and be forgiven. Huh, so she killed her boyfriend or something. I can finally see my beloved. Please forgive me as my hopes on finally seeing you die with me. Hmm. This too must be the will of causality. It was as if she was speaking to an entity that does not exist in this world, says Tanaka. <laughs> then there is nothing to worry about, says Akane. Fine. More importantly, says Tanaka, we should be thinking about the future foundation, our enemy. If that fearsome organization, not all us, world ender is truly responsible for our imprisonment. If you flinch, you will die! Then investigating who's behind that organization is our top priority. 
The future foundation, says Hajime. Hmm. That word, future. Does it have anything to do with that ancient ruin? I mean, there's no doubt that that symbol on the door to the ancient ruin was the Japanese word for future. If that's the case, it might be better if we investigate the ancient ruins again later. However, however, says Sonia, the more I think about it, the less sense it makes. Why would an organization that secretly pl plot in the end of the world make us suffer like this? They went to a lot of trouble to abduct us and bring us to this island, says Kusurio. Hmm. Not only that, they took away several years worth of memories of our lives at Hope Speak Academy. For reasons that are also unknown. <coughs> Future Foundation! World Ender! Ha! Says Mekamaru. Impossible! There's obviously something wrong with you if you believe in something so unrealistic. That, are you freaking kidding me? You became a robot, dude. Hey, hey! Yeah, you're one to talk to Soda. But... But, says Nagito, what we should be most concerned about is as it relates to the Future Foundation. Isn't that right? It's the traitor from the Future Foundation that's hiding among us. Hey. I wonder who it is. The true identity of the outsider hiding among us is trying to ensnare us. I won't be fooled! Nekito's obviously the most suspicious though, says Soda. <laughs> Even a childish organization blattering about ending the world wouldn't accept someone like me. Man. Nobody wants a worthless human, worthless human like me to join their group. <laughs> you guys should know that feeling well, right? You think so? And that's the reason why you're not a traitor, says Chiaki. I do not understand your theory at all. Huh? Then, who do you think is the most suspicious, says Kusuryu? It's obvious. I nominate. Hajime. <gasps> I have been nominated. Huh? Well. Well, isn't it normal to doubt the most unlikely candidate, says Kus uh, Nagito. <laughs> not just that. Uh... You're the only one here who still doesn't know what ultimate talent you possess. If you're basing this on an outsider uh, hiding a mono group of ultimates, Hajime should be doubted right away. I wonder what kind of ultimate I am. I am probably like the ultimate fisher or something. Huh? Then Hajime is a traitor, says Soria. Maybe I am the ultimate traitor and I tra made it like... How do you say it? What is the noun of... Tration? Treason, treason, there you go. I made treason to the corporation that hired me or something. Um, of course not, says Hajime. What are you even saying? <sighs> you shouldn't raise your voice like that, says Nagito. We might become even more suspicious of you, you know. This is obviously your fault, says Hajime. Settle down. Stop fighting, says Sonia. Fool. Don't you think fighting with ourselves like this is Monoguma's trap? says Mekamaru. That might be true, says Kojime, but... <coughs> Alright, I'll handle this. Just leave this matter to me. <coughs> Watch a me... Watch a mean, says Akane while eating. <coughs> to eliminate this tense atmosphere, allow me to present to you my new function that I discovered last night. <gasps> okay, that is going to be the center of the plot of the next murder, so... New function, says Soda. <laughs> Don't tell me. Is it flight? Can you fly? No! It's not a conventional function like that. It's far more practical and novel. <laughs> now then, let's go, says Mekamaru. <laughs> wow! Okay, he can cry cheese. Behold! Nekomaru is crying, says Sonia. No! Hardly. I am not crying. My eyes... <laughs> my right eye dispenses cola. And my left eye dispenses... Rooibos tea. Behold! That is impressive. Maybe he was made out of a dispensing machine. Also, oh, now I see that he's touching his ears. Like, that is beautiful. Are you kidding me? 
I just saw the fountain, says Soda. Damn it. I know we'll be here all day if we keep com commenting on every little thing you do. Don't fuck with me! But what the hell was Monokuma thinking giving you a function like that? Says Kusuryu. You're so evil! That guy, he's definitely fooling around, says Monami. Monokuma's just toying with the other people's bodies. <laughs> I too was modified by Monokuma, so I totally understand how Nekomaru feels. <laughs> but don't be depressed, you'll get used to it. It's surprising how quickly you'll get used to it. I'll beat you up! Don't go butting in our conversation all of a sudden. I'll kill you until you die from it, you stupid rabbit! Says Akane. That's... That's an extremely violent thing to say to someone, says Monomi. Hm. Uh, you showing up at this time means, says Kusuryu. Did you come to tell us that you've defeated another mono beast? Da, 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 you are correct! <laughs> Once again, you can visit a new island, so please take this opportunity to get along with everyone. Huh? I ain't going. What a drag, says Soda. Hmm? Huh? Man. Even if we go to a new island, it's not like we're gonna find a way to escape. Right? You are right. Rather, I feel as though the opportunity to kill increases every time we go to a new island. Says Sonia. Yeah, that happens. The more weapons you get, the easier it is for someone to decide to kill. So it might be best if we do not go. Uh? Huh? I renounce you! I do not know what you're planning, fiend, but we are not going to fall for it, says Tanaka. That's That's a misunderstanding. I was just Lame! Ah oh, jeez, how annoying, says Monokuma. Unbelievable. Just stay back and leave the rest to your big brother. I'll give you an example of how to lure these guys to you, little sis. Hey! What are you doing? You're acting like we're allies or something. Oh, what is that? Letters? Uh. Didn't I tell you to stay back? O U D E S I I C L. Delicious. Delicious? Okay. Uh, yeah, says Mono this Monomi. Technique. It's impossible to defend against it or evade it. Well now. Well now. Uh now that I've mopped up the annoying one. Special bleeding service! Okay, since you guys are feeling down in the dumps. I'll make you guys so excited your noses will bleed. Compared to the earlier investigations, I've prepared a special treat that's completely different than before. Um. Treat? Says Chiaki. Nice! You took the bait? I guess it's true. If you're gonna get a shut-in out of the room, carrots will work best. Huh? Who the cares about that? Hurry up and tell us what the treat is. It's an amazing treat. Don't wet your pants. Well, it's okay if you do. Just don't spray it on me. I've pressed a bunch of stuff you guys might find interesting on the new island. Miracle! Such as clues about the future foundation. Huh? Huh? Says Nagito. <laughs> Such as parts that may be useful for making a ship. You serious? Are you for real? Says Soda. News! And also, your student's profile from the time at Hope Speak Academy. Huh? So... So, do your best to explore. Take care! Okay, there is silence now. Shiagi is gonna talk. She's gonna talk now. Hey, hey! What should we do? You know, right? Our only option is to go, obviously. We might be able to go home if we have a ship... That we have ship parts, says Soda. Yep. I plan to go too, says Nagito. If there are clues about the future foundations, we need to make sure we see them. Hajime. What about you, Hajime? Of course you're going, right? If you look at your student profile, you might be able to find out what your shining talent is. Oh yeah, I'm so interested in that. 
I've been playing this game for so long and since the very beginning they have not told me what I'm you ultimate off, so. It's a chance for you to clear any suspicions, right? What suspicions, says Fajime? I don't think anyone here doubts me. What? Oh, I see, says Nagito. But if there's a clue about my talent, I want to know what it is. The reason Hope Speak About Academy chose me. The talent I possess. These things matter to me. There's no way I'm not worried about it. It seems you'll all prepare yourself for the worst. I'm starting to get pumped up! That means we are going we're gonna go, right? says Akane. I If everyone is going, I shall accompany you as well, says Sonia. Hmm. But there's also a possibility that Monokuma set a trap. We should be careful where we step, says Chiaki. I can't stop thinking about that ancient ruin that might hold clues about the future foundation, says Hajime. But we should start exploring the new island. Uh, maybe I'm, go I'm gonna go to the ruin uh, first then. But that should be in the next episode, so thank you for watching. There's so much food here, I'm so hungry. I'm gonna go eat something and then maybe I'll record another episode of this game. Uh, please check out my content, like and subscribe and see you next time.